<clears throat> Mic check one, two. All right, I hope this works. Hey, what's up, y'all? My name is Billy Visuals. Welcome to this show where we talk about all the hardware for your latest games. This is Gameware to Hardware. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about the Founders Editions Google Stadia hardware. I have not even opened this box. I just received this in the mail. This box is pretty exciting because I've ordered this since July and that whole waiting period, I was just like eager to get it in the mail. So let's dive right into it. So at the front of the box, there's a Google Stadia logo, pretty simple. Aside, it says Stadia's Founders Edition. And at the back, it says, one place for all the ways we play. And then there's the French version because I'm in Canada. They get the English and the French. I can't pronounce it. I'm not great at French. <laughs> Anyways, so let's open this baby up. All right. And let's see what's inside. Wow, that is tight. Ooh, that is so cool. So this is the uh, blue edition of the uh, controller, the Stadia controller, Midnight Blue, I believe. This whole contrast between the blue and the orange is pretty sick. A lot of people online said that it's surprisingly light, but I find it a really comfortable weight. It's not too light where I feel like I don't have a weight in my hands, but man, this feels great. All right, let's put this aside and see what else we got. So there's a little hole there, with the mold from the controller. All right, so we got a USB-C uh, to USB, USB-C to USB charger. So this is the charging brick, pretty straightforward. There's a really colorful tab down here. I'm not sure what that is, but I'm going to pull it out and open it. Um, in here, it's a little sliding thing package. And uh, let's see what's in here. I love the color scheme of Stadia, just putting it out there. I think everything about it is pretty cool. So this is a little letter saying, the promise of creating one place for all the ways we play is a long held dream. Today, we're proud to see that dream becoming a reality. A community of players is the core of Stadia. Thank you for the first to gather around. Pretty awesome. So there's a manual for Stadia, and because it doesn't come with a console, all you have is just the controller, and then you got the Chromecast in here. They also give you stickers. I'm not sure where to put these stickers, but these are pretty dope. If you want them, let me know. So this is the Chromecast Ultra. This apparently has the latest uh, software so that you can use this with the Google Stadia. Um, at the back, there's like a magnet. So technically, it is this console, but you can also use a computer with a Chrome browser. Um, but if you want to connect to your TV, you would need this Chromecast. And inside the box, what we have left is this power brick. And uh, this power brick has a USB micro, micro USB charger that goes into Chromecast. And in this brick, there's also Ethernet port. So in case that you want to play hardwired, you can do that right there. All right, so these are the, all the main components that comes with the Founders Edition box. It's pretty sick, and I really like this color on the controller. Wow, I'm kind of blown away at how comfortable it is. I have a uh, Nintendo Switch Pro controller. Let's see, let me just bring that up to see if we can compare it. All right, so I just brought over the Nintendo Switch Pro controller. As you can see, this is the Stadia controller. So the controller for the Nintendo Switch has this like diagonal pattern for your thumbs. And this one has more of like a, similar to what PlayStation has with the bottom analog sticks and then the D-pad and the buttons here. So comparing the weights to it, I feel like the Pro Controller is actually lighter, but there's like a nice decent weight to the uh, Stadia controller that I don't think um, feels terrible at all. All right, so these are all the physical components to the Google Stadia's Founder Edition box. If you have any questions about the kit, let me know in the comment section below, and I'll try to answer you as best as I could. I hope you all are excited about this technology as much as I am, because I'm ready to set this up and test it out. Anyways, this has been Billy Visuals. Y'all just got visualized, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.